Okay, here we're on my little sample page right now, but we're going to create a new page because, well, you're going to want to create your own pages for your user. So we're going to go to this little library book button on the top left-hand corner and click that. And then we're going to click the plus button right here in the top right-hand corner to open up this new board creator. We're on a, we have title, dimension, folder, modifiable, home board, and notes. For right now, I'm just going to create a title for this board. And I'm just going to name it Sample 2 because I already have a sample board. And I just, I don't want to get confused. All right, we did that. We're going to put down that board, uh, keyboard, and we're going to change the dimensions. For right now, I don't want a dynamic right now. I want to create a 2x2, two two, which is only four buttons. This is a static board. And when you have a static board, uh, buttons stay stable or stay still. And when you have a dynamic board, it will expand as you add on to it. For right now, I'm just going to use the 2x2 two two static board. So I'm going to hit save, and then it automatically pops up. We just click here to pull that, that back. All right, now. We're just going to add buttons that are already created for uh, the application already. Right now I'm on food, but we click this little filing cabinet again. We go to adjectives, and we could do, we have these as our options to add on to our board. So, we want to click on this book icon again to bring back our board. And when, we, when we're on this uh, here, we click on this little rectangle button on the top left hand corner again and we can put oh let's just put first fast good and great and there you go you just first. created you created your first board